And this is where it begins, where countless lessons in manhood and all the things that nobody else ever teaches you actually take place, where we unveil the secrets to how men actually think. The things we talk about in well tiled, marble bathrooms, water coolers, shower stalls, quite a few other places, as a matter of fact. <laughs> and you might actually learn a thing or two or three if you stick around with us. This is the most interesting show to make landfall on television with the three most interesting men who are capable of holding on to it. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Men's Corner. Flirting, how do you define flirting? I mean, how do you define life? You don't define flirting, you just put limits to, you know, to flirting. For me, flirting is just, uh, hi, I like your shoes, you smell nice, you know, and it ends there. Flirting is PR for sex. It's like, would you like to have sex with me? Look at the benefits of having sex with me. Flirting is over friendliness attached with sexuality. Let me try and sound intelligent for There's no definition for flirting. No, defined, no definition for flirting. If you're going to flirt, um, the first thing you need to know is you need to know yourself. You, you can't be flirting and saying things that uh, contradict you, like um, I'm a quiet person. Really, you're saying it, you're talking already. You're not really quiet. Um, make sure you are comfortable flirting. Like, you know those type of flirtings where you're watching like a movie and you're sucking on a cucumber and you're just looking at it. As a girl though, obviously, trying to let him know how you get down. You need to be careful that you're comfortable with it. You don't want to flirt and now start choking. If you're a guy, you need to wait for the girl to notice you. I realize that whether we like it or not, women tend to pick the guys. We never actually pick them. We think we have game, but nah, they've already selected you. So just find the female that has selected you and go and display your PR for her. That's the main role of flirting. Don't be forward. Let her do all the work. Why else are you flirting? Flirting ends up in sex. I mean, you're showing you a woman you have curves. You're showing you a guy that you are a Real man, you're an alpha male. Of course, that's where it's going to end up. No, I think, you know, it only gets sexual when, it only gets sexual when you push the limits, you know? There's nothing like intellectual flirting or mathematical flirting. Flirting is flirting. The minute I'm talking to you because I'm trying to get you wet or I'm trying to get you aroused or I'm trying to get you excited, I'm trying to get you sexually interested in me, whatever it is, as long as sex is involved somehow, it's flirting. When you're flirting, you're like a peacock. You're showing your colors and you want a female or a male to be attracted to you. That's all flirting is. It's just you want sex and you bring out your public relation machinery to achieve sex. That's all flirting is. You should actually create your environment for flirting because the environment is very, very key. I mean, the more in control you are of your environment, the better the flirting experience. I find that good R&B in your car is a very fantastic place to flirt. If you can't control the environment, you want to be careful about flirting. You know, you don't want to flirt with a girl in a restaurant and have her pour her drink in your face. You need to control the elements. The best environments are the environments you can control. That's the only thing that will make it conducive. You can control the environment. Welcome back to Men's Corner where very little seriousness actually takes place. Now, you've seen a lot of the viewpoints that our male uh, contributors had on the art of flirting, but we're going to take a break, and when we get back from that, we'll see what our beautiful queens have to say. See how I'm staying very social media friendly and out of harm's way? <laughs> beautiful queens, not female, not girls, not chicks. Not Mazina. Oh, no. come on, stop. <laughs> That's a good shot. We'll go, we'll go off for a break, and then we'll be right back on Men's Corner. The problem with you men, yes, I said you men, is that you never really read this body language right. It's like, you wouldn't know flirting if it knocks you in the face. It's right there, I'm trying to tell you something. Can you see, like, do I have to spell it all out? And the issue is, if I come straight out to tell you what I want, ah, now what for this girl, oh, she's a rosco, she's easy, she's this, she's that. Okay, so I'm just laying out little tiny bits of slight information just so that you can get what I'm trying to say, but still, no. So please, flirting, I am trying to tell you something and you can only hear it if you're listening and looking 
at me, all right? So it's just teasing, it's toying with you and trying to pass across a message that either I'm attracted to you or I can tell that you're attracted to me and I want something deeper than whatever relationship we have at that point. Sometimes though, it could be for a misbit, you know, like I'm just trying to have fun, I'm trying to toy with you a little, uh, see how you would react, you know, catch crews with everything, not necessarily sexual. Sometimes it could be because I need a favor, but more often than not, like 90% of the time it is sexual, I'm thinking, I really want to get with you like that. Like that. So yeah, sexual, 90%. Oh, I smiled at someone. And he thought I was into him. I wasn't. I was just smiling, because I'm a nice person. All right, so we have the ladies' opinions. And it's time to get a few of the, 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 the fellas. Just it's okay to say the that. Fellas in here, right? The fellas in here, who would, it would be great if they would actually, you know what, never mind. Yeah, would let's let's just go. So, what is it? Is it an art, is it a science, or is it a waste of time? I'll, to me. I'll tell you what it is. As opposed to being an Arsenal awesome supporter. <laughs> let, me, let me tell you what it is already. <laughs> <laughs> we actually yeah. we actually don't know we're doing it as men. Wait, wait, hold on. No, but really. Men don't know they're flirting? We don't know we're doing it. Girls Sometimes just they do. Most times we don't. Girls think just think times. we I are. I think sometimes mm -hmm. we don't. I don't know about most times. But I know it's possible to flirt, I don't know. I, I think we know every time we flirt. No, I don't. How do you not know you're flirting? Because what, what women, I almost said female, but, uh, <laughs> what women define as flirting sometimes for you is not. Yeah, women have a much deeper view of flirting than men. Have. You could be standing in a corner with a, with a beer in your hand and they'll think, oh, he's, he's coming at me. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes it's a long stare. You know, Sometimes it's just a long stare. Let's say you're 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 in you're you're in a, 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 your favorite watering hole and you have a glass and you're doing this. That's flirting. And you're doing this. That's flirting. It is. <laughs> and now you're doing that. Absolutely. What is wrong with you? <laughs> no, but absolutely that's flirting. But the fact is this here, I believe that women flirt um, much more deliberately. Than we do. Yeah. Yes. They they go home and say tonight I'm going out for some flirting. No, they say they say I'm gonna go out. I'll wear that dress that makes everybody. And I'm gonna sit by the bar. I'll sit yeah. by the bar. With my red the lipstick. lighting is really great. The one that says flirt Make with sure me. Make sure the Louboutins are showing. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And every time a nice handsome dude walks past, I'll do this. You're pretty good at that. I'm very worried. <laughs> <laughs> but back to it now. Okay. So. We don't often know if we're flirting. That's no. that's the consensus, right? Yeah. So and I think for some guys, it's just it's it's a lot of things because I don't know. I think for people, what is flirting actually? Exactly. Because that's even what I want to okay. know. You know what? Then, let's, let's start from ground zero. What is flirting? Can we Google? Nah. No. 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 <laughs> no. Experience I, will have to come into play here. I will define mind. it as as the art of getting attention, um, with a motive of probably coitus. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with your throat? <laughs> I don't know, has that effect on me? <laughs> but yes. Is it only coitus? Um, there might be other reasons. Who the hell says coitus? <laughs> <laughs> Who? If, if there are any financial motives, then that's a different topic. What if you wanted a relationship? Yeah. Instead of as just Can flirting lead to a know? relationship? Of course. It can, it's, it's not a... I has mean, it hey, ever happened to you? Can't tell that Actually, on television. Actually, can't you just flirt for the... Just, just for the hell of it. Yeah, no, 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 no. That word, never. For the heck of it. <laughs> <laughs> because people do. True. I know people who do that, and they just do it. And they go home, just to screw people's minds. Ah. Just because it was Thursday, and there was nothing good on TV. Yeah, and it's a sport. Yeah. So who does that the most? Women. Yeah, women I, do that. Women do that the most. I think most. they will not agree, line. but it's a fact that women do. Ah. Uh, Oh man, this is just gonna cause a cycle in the sense that, you know, women will say men flirt the most. Men will say, no, women flirt, but it's very coded. But it doesn't really matter, does it? Um, but I'd say men flirt most. Uh, <laughs> you know, the truth about it is, I feel like women actually flirt more because they're allowed to. A woman will look at you sexy, she'll tilt, show your boobs, she'll, you know, try and come close to you, touch your hair. And then the minute you try and touch her back, she'll say, ah, kill day. <laughs> you know, so women do that a lot, you know, and they get away with it. So because of that, they do it more. Definitely men. It's, I think it's in their DNA. I think guys flirt more because it's, uh, 
uh, if I could call it, occupational hazard of being a guy. Sometimes they even flirt without realizing that they are flirting. Guys, if you flirt now, while I did, you can't, you know, tweet at a girl or say, you know what, you're looking nice before they'll say you're thirsty or they'll say, yeah. But if a girl does it the other way around, it's cool. So yeah, women flirt better. For a woman to flirt with you, she has given it a lot of thought. You know, she has made a, she's making a conscious effort. It's not just out of a whim. For men, they will flirt with anything and anybody at any time. You just have to be female. Right now, in this world that we're living in, you don't even have to be female, really. <laughs> I'm just saying. All right, so yes, men do flirt a lot more than women. Women wake up and they have a bad day at work and they decide, you know what? A little bit of flirting wouldn't help. Go out <laughs> I mean, wouldn't, wouldn't be too bad. And I leave 20 men staring through the windscreen like this. With these. <laughs> these. <laughs> ah, oh, I was looking for it, my man. <laughs> Oh no! This is your well delivered. <laughs> well delivered. No. What Ebuka actually means to say is all women are secretly looking for a way to deliver the number two. <laughs> the color, not the well, Yeah, you know, it's it's really just the number. <laughs> the color might be important. Who knows? All right. Okay. But, so you say women do it more deliberately, but who does it more? Obviously, in volume. Yeah. In volume, men, men do. Men. But like I said from the start. We don't do it deliberately. We don't know we're doing it. I don't buy that. Is, no, no, but I don't buy that. I'll I don't. Wait, wait. No. Now I want to ask. I have never flirted and not known I was flirting. Ever. You're a different. So what is the species. definition of flirting? At least I'm. What is your definition of flirting, Andre? My definition? This. Would you say paying a compliment is flirting? Hell no. Good because some question. girls think it's flirting. No, no, no. Why would you think pay? What? You hug her. Oh my. Woo. Hugging is going too today. far. For some people, it's like, oh, what do you want? I if think, you think I'm flirting, if I pay you a compliment, I'd like to see what farm you were raised on. Well, you know, Blaze, I think flirting is already going too far. You don't, I mean, sorry, hugging is already going too far. <laughs> flirting is a topic. <laughs> hugging is going too far already. Most times, you don't even have to get there. You just simply have to say, hey, nice dress, or you look good. Ooh, wait, wait, wait. And then, some people think that's flirting. Exactly. I've got a scenario. I've got a scenario. So, you don't know you're flirting or you're not flirting. You're paying but a compliment. It's or you think you're not flirting. You think you're not flirting. How do you... This is becoming a Jedi mind trick, man. <laughs> so you think you're not flirting, but you're actually flirting? Is that like using the force in your suit? These are not the girls it. you're looking for. <laughs> okay, so Men's Corner can't seem to come to an agreement as to who's the greater flirt, who flirts more frequently, or why on earth Mazzino seems to be the one person who thinks he's an authority on flirting? Queen Mazzino. Queen Mazzino. Hey guys, yeah. come on, really? <laughs> like, I'm gonna change your ringtone on my phone. I think we should decide in I'm the like next. Like, Anis Day or something. <laughs> <laughs> decide, decide in the next segment who the biggest flirt is. Fine, the biggest flirt in the house plus worst flirting experiences. Sound he good? just got married, by the way. Is this? Right. Wait, what? Nothing. You can't snitch on. No. Wow. You know what? I'm, we, I'm leaving this place. Yes, yes. <laughs> We're just going to leave Mazzino here all by himself. Men's Corner will be back in a I'm second. I'm sorry. Hi, this is Go. Men's Corner, and we're, we'll be safe in a second after Ma Mazzino potted the white wall. Okay. <laughs> Right, so welcome back to Men's Corner. <laughs> Clearly some people are not ever going to go for the Billet World Championships, no. but that's neither here nor there. Who is the worst flirt in the house? And by worst, I mean best. Worst? I don't know. What, what, Who is the greatest flirt in here? Simple. In here? In here. Depends right. what gender you're directing how, that how question you know to. That, okay, let's let's do it. You must be good at it. You're a friend. Do you think you do it a lot? I'll tell you a story, yeah? When I was younger, and I am still young, um, I <gasps> we would never have guessed. <laughs> I'm only 16. Um, I used to, I used to always get like two years later. I'd get, you know, the girls would come back and say, "Oh, you were doing this." I never knew that I was flirting, and you know, it, it was always like um, a natural thing. Obviously, being charming is wow. mistaken for being a flirt. So I'm not saying I'm the best. No, that's you're not what I'm very saying. modest. I like you're very you're modest. So modest. Absolutely modest. Ah. Thank you very much. <laughs> but. He's worse. <laughs> <laughs> you know. But interestingly, I agree with you because I I also get that um. You know, you think Feedback. you're being cheerful, or you yeah. think like that's why I talked about compliments earlier. Because mm -hmm. sometimes you're just giving a compliment, or you yeah. think I'm just having a nice conversation. I'm trying to keep a conversation going. Details, please. Meanwhile, the person has gotten this. <laughs> Let's hear it. G give us an instance. I don't know that I have any crazy experiences per se, but I think on a general note, it's just mostly yeah, you thinking you're just having a conversation. I mean, it's a cocktail. It's a dinner. 
mm-hmm. you're going to make new friends and you're trying yeah. to have a conversation. Uh, then you yeah. go and you're like, wow, you just left me after I, like, I thought you were. Yeah, interested. Like, uh, not really. Uh, I can't relate to either of these viewpoints. Give us your experience. Uh, hmm, let's see. Well, so <clears throat> I've been accused of flirting. A thousand times. Shut up. But <laughs> <laughs> it's almost never, I've never all, uh, succeeded. It's okay. I've never been in the center of it. Shut up. Shut up. You were always <laughs> deliberately flirting. He never well, succeeded. Let's look at it this way. I was not always <laughs> deliberately flirting. But if, if I'm in a space where I'm interested in the attention and it comes my way, why, why would I say no? If you don't like the person. If it's a enough. two instead of an eight. Well, if she, Sometimes it's just loot. You don't want to carry the loot. If yeah. of course I'm not talking physically. I'm talking physically. Lude. Yeah. Wow. Yes. Let's, let's go there. With the <laughs> I've had this fun experience, however. I don't know if it's really, if it's really related to what we're talking about, but this one time, um, I was at this party, it was a wedding, and then this very beautiful girl, you know, we started, you know, relating. I don't know if I started it or if she, if she did. And um, it got to a point where we were certain this was going to lead into a relationship and everything until I Wait, found out. Wait, this is at one party? It was a wedding party. Was <laughs> and you were certain about a relationship I was at certain. a wedding party? You can tell from the start. You Why? Can, you can, How? It's a thing I just have. Oi, <laughs> 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 hey, listen. Hey, can I finish the story? Can I finish the story? I was certain... Did World War II <laughs> No. you were having a sandwich? No, but you <laughs> see, <laughs> thing is... Your time skills. I was certain it was going to work out until her mother alerted her that I was her cousin. And that was the end of that very short so, relationship. So, wait, you didn't know you... Wait, I didn't know. Wait, it was a big party. Wait, it was Roman, a family. No, wait, 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 Juliet, wait, 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 wait. At a so wedding you're, you're party. A, was, it was a, a family... A big family, you know, thing. Well, You've not everybody was family. Before. Never. But she looked really She'd good. She'd never met you before. No. It was a family. And you knew that this could be like a story relationship. Complete. I feel like you did more than just... I don't yeah. know. I now you were too you're embarrassed. I swear to God, to nothing happened. You were too numb as you know. Nothing happened. No! That is just wrong. Stop. <laughs> it never happened. It, no, no, it didn't. It was just, it was just like, it, it all happened just in an peck. hour. It, no. Mazino Peck. No Peck. Did you guys hug really close? No. Did you have that, Can we move know, on? Jack and whatever her name I is. I regret starting this story. <laughs> I absolutely regret Where is she starting right now? this story. I do not. She's married and that's it. Guys. What's her husband's name? Let's I, speak out. <laughs> And say hi. Don't make me swear. <laughs> <laughs> Please. Wow, your cousin, that's deep though. Guys, I, I, this is a lesson I will not tell that I kind have, of story. I have, I have, I have, I, I've seen a, a girl flirt. And I mean a girl because we were both very young. Okay. And she saw this guy and she decided, him. And she cut across the room, went, stood beside him. Zip and he line. was with a girl. So she stood behind the girl. And she made eye contact with this guy for about seven seconds. And that was it. How did it end up? And the guy How do you think it? it ended up? I do not want to know. No, you don't. I do <laughs> want to know. Yeah, you're different. I'll tell you. Not <laughs> kissing Cousin Smith over here. That's not happening. Hey, come on. I'm going to be the butt of every show. Am I not? Is this what it's going this to be? This is Man's no, Corner. <laughs> <laughs> we will take a short break so Mazzino can take deep breaths and return to normal humanity. When we get back, we're going oh, to be boy. looking at the do's and don'ts of flirting as taught by the maestros of the business, Ebuka and Mazino. I will be here with notes, learning. I'm Andre, we'll be right back. Flirting situation gone wrong when you flirt with an SU. That's just wrong. Just like Ferrari, brick wall. That's as simple as to describe it. You know, you're watching a movie and then you don't see that it's starting to happen and then you're not trying to touch her. And she's like, what? This has been Men's Corner, guys. Thank you very much for your opinions. This has been fantastic. Always a pleasure. Uh, I, oh, by the way, I meant guy. Guy. <laughs> so, Mazzino, uh, ladies' restroom is that way. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. We will be back. Mazzino, come on, let me finish between you. Yeah, yeah, why not? Nah, you don't even get a cue stick anymore. Wow, <laughs> what is your problem? <laughs>
You're a sore loser, man. You're a sore loser. Do not flirt with an SU. Do not flirt with a church girl that's not a freak. I think that's pretty much it. Yeah, that's, that's pretty much my dreams and dogs. It's not every time you have to flirt. Let it pass. You could see a fine girl, let her pass. You don't have to flirt every time. But the major number one rule of flirting, and I will repeat it, do not flirt when you're in the group, except she's the ugliest one. That's the only time. Try to smile a little. Smile a little, especially if you have a pretty smile. It goes a long way. I mean, a, a, a man can't disarm you with a smile if his smile is awesome. She's like, oh my god, please can you do that again? I'm actually thinking about somebody smile while I'm saying this. <laughs> what I'm saying is, yeah. When you're reflecting, especially if you're in a relationship, do not leave receipts. Do not leave receipts. Chat on Snapchat. <laughs>